Alright, uh, pizza review time. Let's go this way. Like, so we get the back. Uh, uh, do we have the background? We're at Royal Ascot, England. Are you coming? We're here, pizza review time. Special guest. I don't know how special it is. First of all, we're at the Wood Fired Pizza Company inside Royal Ascot. We're with Bradley Weisberg, who demanded he be a special guest. So, our last guest, I don't know if you'll be able to hear us, the Diplo Paris Hilton, uh, basically A list celebrities, and Bradley Weisberg. We gotta let We're these in the people way. out of the yeah, way. Yeah. Don't let them go. Go ahead. Make sure here. you get the sauce. Here. Let's go down. Bradley, big horse guy. He's the one who hooked us up with the tickets. The hat. Beautiful top hat here. You have to wear top hats or else you're not allowed. He paid $6,000 for this hat. And he six, paid six cents. Oh no, I have a rental. I've never been here. I've been, and it looks just as good. You've been chirping me about the hat. You're Sorry. proud of your hat. I could have bought that hat for $17 and made it look the same way. Definitely couldn't have done it. And I, was, I will say it's great to have you here. But walking around with you in that hat is pretty embarrassing. So now let's go. Slice. I know well, the you rules. want to tell people who you are? So like, why do you have this guy? Who you're, they're gonna, you know what they're going to say? I put you in this because I'm much taller than you and I want to seem tall. So tell them why you, who are you, what do you do, why do you deserve to be a feature here? Brad Weisbord, love the racehorse business. I buy, sell, trade racehorses. One bite, one bite, take it easy. One bite, everyone knows the rules. Are we, allowed, are we allowed to say where we're sitting or do we get in trouble? No, let's not say where we're sitting. We're here at Royal Ascot. It's the Royal Meeting, one of the best race events in the world. I've introduced Dave to this Royal Ascot meeting mainly because I know he loves horse racing. So it's glad to have him here. One bite. I'm going to try it too. They tell me they're one not bite. open pizza in England. I want to say where we're sitting. Can we give them a small guess? Tell them where we're sitting. Well, it's, it's the, the king of Qatar. Ruler of Qatar. Ruler of Qatar. What's his name? The Altani family. The Altani family. Guests of them. Guests of them. One of the top racehorse owners in the world. So. I bet you're not sitting with the ruler of Qatar today. People out there. I'm going to. this hat. I'm going to grade first. Go. Well, you always do. Yes. You can go ahead. One bite. You know, you can only take one bite. The pizza. All right. Not bad. So, Involving a guest. That's pretty good. I will give this a 3.8. Now let me say this, 3.8, not a rookie score, not a rookie score. We're in England. They're not known for their pizza. They don't know Italians. They don't know sauce. They don't know cheese. They know tea. It's 3.8, no good. I'm done with it. That's my review. I think 3.8 is fair. It's a little harsh. It's actually not as bad, especially, by the way, racetrack pizza. I insulted Churchill Downs with theirs because they gave it like a two. This is better than that. I'm actually going to go with the 4.1. Okay. It's not the worst pizza I've ever heard. England not known for their food in general. Now, if you dip it in this, I don't know what type of sauce they give you here, garlic sauce, you'd be puking all day long. That, yeah, garlic herb. Garlic herb. So what do you give it? 3.8. I'm 4.1. Thank you to the ruler of Qatar for the seats. Thank you to Bradley. By far, the least known celebrity, and really not celebrity, at least known guest we've ever had on this. But if you give me seats in the rule of Qatar's box, you can weasel your way into a pizza review. So that's our review. England, top of the day.